So as far as gender um, playing a role in the work and us being a all-male company, uh, that decision kind of came from looking at the male dance companies um, in and out of New York. There's this kind of, typically there's this drive to be, oh, we're macho, we're masculine, we're manly men dancing in through the work that we've done with other choreographers and just our experience, it was, it's more interesting to play both sides of gender for us. Not to say that we necessarily play up the femininity of, of anything, but we don't shy away from it and it's not something that... It's thought about. It, it's, yeah, it's actually not a concern. It's not um, something we're afraid of. It's, it's a duality that truly is in all of us and we just let it exist. It's very important, the, the, the humanity in it, the sensitivity in it, the expression, um, along with the athleticism and the, 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 the large moves. Like it, it, it is important to, to kind of tap into the fact that, you know, at the end of the day, we're, we're still human beings, regardless of gender or, or aesthetic, or um, that we are, we're people. And um, there's a lot of... We struggle with things. There's a lot of things that that we we deal with um, every day, and I think it it just it kind of reveals itself within the movement and and the the conceptual aspects of the work too. Mm -hmm.